Hello everyone, my name is Samuel Burkett and I'm one of the marketing mentors from Entrepreneur Education in Surfers Paradise on the Gold Coast. Today, I wanna to give you a quick overview of an important element in marketing, that being search engine optimization or SEO for short. The question is, what is SEO? Simply put, SEO determines how much visibility your website receives by how high it is ranked on a search engine results page or S-E-R-P, SERP for short. If we are talking about Google, the search engine has smart algorithms that are tasked to sort, process, and find the most relevant website that will relate to a person's individual search request. For example, right now I feel like getting a fresh juice, so I type into the search bar, where can I find a fresh juice? And immediately we have a bunch of options that we can choose from on the very first page. So let's say that, okay, what's the first one here? Juices from Woolworths. All right, let's have a look at some cold press fresh juices. What do they have? Okay, this doesn't really relate to what I'm looking for. So I might come back and say, well, let's see if this one is a bit better. This uh, from uh, Cali Press. Let's have a look. And okay, 100% raw, organic, fantastic. That's what I'm looking for. Uh, a fresh juice that I can quickly grab and go about my day. That's what I'm looking for. Great. So I'm going to come back here and I'm going to think to myself, well, that's fantastic. I already have what I need. I can go about doing what I needed to do without thinking about this ever again. But what about all these other websites providing juice? Like down here, we've got Groove Juice, we've got Fruit Juices. Uh, fruit juices manufacturer from Mountain Fresh Fruit Juices. Chances are I may not even look at these because I have already found a juice up here at Cold Press Juices, the Cali Press website. And it is rare that I'll have to go to the second page of my search results to find a good fresh juice down here. So page number two, if we come to this, there is a whole bunch of other options there that I might not even come to. So why does this matter? Well, if you are trying to sell juice and your website is not tailored towards search engine optimization, then those Google algorithms we were just talking about will not pick your website when someone searches, where can I find a fresh juice? And they will not rank them as high as other websites, such as when we come back to page one, they will not be ranked as high as Woolworths or Cali Press. Now, the Google algorithms may see that your website does provide information about where to buy juice, but if your website is not user-friendly, has numerous links to unrelated information, or even takes too long to load, then your website may be put onto page three, five, or even 10 of the search results. This is an issue if you want users searching, where can I find fresh juice to see your website and potentially buy your juice. So when you are thinking about marketing and your role is to drive awareness of a brand, product or service, then your website needs to be catered towards search engine optimization. The better you can please those algorithms, the higher your website will be listed on the search engine results page, as we were discussing just before up here. So these three options are the highest ranked at the moment. They have good search engine optimization because Google has listed them as being the most relevant to this search. Great, so for more information, feel free to read through the below blog. I discuss a few ways to have search engine optimization work for you and a link to some helpful resources. All right, that is all from me until the next blog and thank you very much for your time. Have a great day.